My research over the last 40 years has been focused on insulin resistance in every organ in the body. And why? It causes inflammation. So again, we can talk about uh, insulin resistance in the fat cells, which causes you to gain weight. Insulin resistance in the uh, pancreas that causes you to basically have lower blood sugar. Insulin resistance in the heart that causes heart disease. But insulin resistance can also occur in the brain. And this is why it's a driving force for both Alzheimer's and also Parkinson's disease. Because as you get insulin resistance, your body's ability to convert food into energy, the fuel of the body, is compromised. And in the brain, even though it consists of only 2% of the weight of the total body, it uses up 20% of the energy. And so if you have insulin resistance in the brain, the, body, the brain's ability to maintain itself is highly compromised. So again, uh, when, you, when you look to control insulin resistance, say, how to do it? Well, I can say now after 40 years, the best way to control insulin resistance in every organ in your body is to follow metabolic engineering. And why? because it's designed to basically reduce insulin resistance. How? By making your metabolism more effective. And how does it do that? It activates AMPK, the master regular of metabolism in each year 30 trillion cells.